Hi everybody, Cheaply Chic. Welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, welcome. I'm so glad you're here. Today's video, I am sharing the extra items that will be available in my Etsy shop tomorrow, which is Friday, October 23rd at noon Eastern Standard Time. These items will be released at the same time as the October monthly collection, which is called So Blessed. And just to give you a little sneak peek at the journal if you missed it, that is what this looks like. I'm super, super excited about that one. I'm planning on using mine as a gratitude journal for the month of November. So yeah, super excited. But today I am jumping in and I will share the ephemera packs with you. First, I'll share these little ruffles. I love this fabric. This is some older fabric, probably from the 80s or 90s that I had picked up and I just love it. I think it's lovely. So there's about 24 inches of ruffle here and I think it's just beautiful with this journal or any, you know, any natural nature type journal that you're going to create. So yes, I will have a few of these in the shop. I always like putting together some of the playing card sets that I have left from, you know, building the collections and things. This is the greeting card. Well, one of them in the main kit. There's another one right here. You'll, if you order this collection tomorrow, you will either receive this one or this one. And they are both fabulous. I love them. So I have a few of these card sets. This one is included here. They all come in a little glassine bag and there are 11 playing cards all together. So just to show you, they're all autumn or fall themed. That one's more of a horse theme, I guess, but I thought that tree looks like it had some autumn <laughs> leaves on there. This beautiful lady walking her dog in the sunflowers and the autumn leaves there. Pretty pheasant. I've used this in a kit before. It's not really autumn. You can see the tree hasn't changed, but I love that. I love this card so much. I love the farmhouse feel. So I just thought it went well with these cards. Little Norman Rockwell print. And last but not least, I also had quite a few extra fall napkins. So I thought those of you who enjoy decoupage, you know, might enjoy some of these. So a Ray Dunn thankful napkin. There is a couple little pumpkins and thankful on that one. Another thankful napkin. I love this one, pick your own pumpkin patch. Hello fall. This one's really pretty, has a bunch of flowers and acorns and pumpkins. Another pumpkin and sunflower print. And then Actually, the, these two napkins are in the main collection release tomorrow as well. I just love them. This one is awesome. I love this napkin. So it's really large and on the inside it has a recipe for a pumpkin sheet cake. How fun is that? I thought this was awesome. So that's a lot of fun. I'm excited about this napkin. <laughs> So anyway, I had some of those and a few of these sets will be available and I will hop into the 15 piece ephemera pack and I'm just going to work off the stack this time. I've used this in the past, last year. I had this game, it's called the Thanksgiving game and there were these I'm thankful for cards. So I just think that's, you know, awesome and would be a lot of fun. There is one mini CD envelope, this autumn vintage playing card. There is one leaf craft tag, one strip of six orange vintage tickets. This is a Thanksgiving napkin ring. It's a cardboard chipboard type material napkin ring that you would use, you know, something fun at a Thanksgiving party. But how fun is that turkey 
and those leaves. I love that piece. There is one vintage flash card. There is one tag that I hand stamped with these adorable mushrooms, one smaller alteration tag, one layaway tag, one white time card, one of these plaid thankful napkins, a little leaf cupcake pick, one of these pumpkin and acorn napkins for decoupage. There is a library card and pocket. And then there is a whole sheet of little labels that are just always great to have on hand. So that is everything in the 15 piece ephemera pack. And then the 30 piece ephemera pack, there are two of these little maple leaf craft tags. At least I think they're maple leaves. One vintage playing card, a second playing card, one yellow coin envelope. There is an old alphabet flash card and on the back of each of them is an image. J for juggle, right? So those are a lot of fun. There are two of those I am thankful for cards. One Ray Dunn thankful napkin. One vintage score sheet for a bridge game. One library card in pocket. One old library card catalog card. <laughs> One of those Thanksgiving napkin rings, another old flash card, a manila tag that I stamped that adorable little mushroom on, an inventory tag that has that carbon copy on there, two green guest checks, one recipe card with this great little pheasant there in the bottom, one strip of six green old tickets, one time card, one old bingo card, one of these larger guest checks that have a carbon copy as well. One give thanks paper bag. One little paper treat bag that I stamped this little scarecrow in the pumpkin patch stamp. I love that. One hello fall napkin. One Edith Holden book page with some fall images on there. This is a piece of office stationary letterhead paper. I loved the deeper warm colors and it has this great little floral image at the bottom. Another page of some Avery labels and then a random book page out of an old dried flowers book that I thought was really cute. So that is everything in the 30 piece of femur pack and that is all the extra items that I will have in the shop tomorrow. So just a reminder for those of you interested, the main collection release as well as all of these things will be in my shop tomorrow, Friday, October 23rd at noon Eastern Standard Time. The video for the main kit release where I'm sharing everything that's in the collection, I will be posting that at 11 Eastern Standard Time. So there will be an hour delay before the release and that's so everybody has a chance to see the video first if they're interested because the collections do sell out rather quickly. So thank you guys so much. If you have any questions at all, feel free to message me on Etsy. It's probably the simplest, quickest way to get a hold of me because I see that a lot quicker than I see comments here on YouTube. Otherwise, you guys, thank you so much for taking the time to watch. I appreciate it. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.